The Hong Kong Biodiversity and Conservation 10-Year Review summarizes how Hong Kong performed in biodiversity conservation in the past decade. The Hong Kong Birdwatching Society found that the current Biodiversity Strategy and Action Plan BSAP, and conservation policies in Hong Kong are far from adequate to protect our biodiversity or to meet the global conservation targets under the Convention on Biological Diversity. So what are our recommendations to improve conservation in Hong Kong? Commit to CBD and national policy. There is an urgent need for the Hong Kong government to articulate a comprehensive biodiversity conservation policy framework that puts meeting its CBD responsibilities at the core. It would need to be aligned with the CBD's post-2020 biodiversity framework and China's key conservation policies. As the first BSAP expires at the end of 2021, the next BSAP should also be drafted based on the lessons learned in the first BSAP and should be in line with the above policy frameworks. Enhance enforcement through regulation and resourcing. Amendments to the Town Planning Ordinance, Environmental Impact Assessment Ordinance and Waste Disposal Ordinance are needed to reduce frequent eco-vandalism. Ordinances for the protection of wild animals and plants and habitats also require updates. These long-standing loopholes in the terms and enforcement of existing policies, legislation and planning processes needs to be plugged so as to stop the ongoing habitat destruction and the illegal wildlife trade. Halt biodiversity loss. Rezoning land within country parks, agricultural lands, green belts and other conservation zonings for development is the main cause of accelerating ecological loss and should be stopped. Hong Kong should immediately adopt the principle of environmentally sustainable use of land resources. Secure the protected area network. Hong Kong should protect and secure the existing country parks and marine park system. Designated Robin's Nest Country Park to protect cross-border ecological corridor without further delay. Establish meaningful marine protected areas and formulate biodiversity management plans for its country parks and marine parks. Mainstream Biodiversity Conservation Conservation of biodiversity should not only lie in the hands of the environmental authorities and environmental NGOs, but also in the hands of other bureaus, works departments, private sector and the general public. Engaging and empowering all sectors and relevant stakeholders in early planning and decision making are needed to meet Hong Kong's CBD responsibility. Please refer to the Hong Kong Birdwatching Society's latest reports for more details.